Welcome back to another one of uh, the BMX um, part. I'm just going to grind some of this down, weld and everything. The music in the background is just me listening to the, to the radio, so don't mind it. There's a couple of things here that I didn't take into account for. Um, the spark plug and the wire. So I had to add this piece here for the gas tank in order to clear the spark plug. I didn't take into account for the carburetor either. I'm happy that works out. There's hardly no room there whatsoever. Like I can move it ahead a little bit. But there's hardly no room there whatsoever. And another thing I didn't take account for is the chain. I'm wondering if it's going to hit this bar right here. So I'm going to go ahead and, and uh, put the chain on and see if I have to do a modification to this bar. And another thing is I've been watching um, some YouTube videos. Supposedly I was supposed to put the offset on the rear sprocket facing in. And I just guessed because I didn't have any plans I put it facing out. So I'll see if the alignment is right. If not, then I'll have to uh, flip it over. But this is how it's coming so far. Um, yeah, I didn't. I didn't take into account for the spark plug. Too bad the spark plug couldn't be facing the other way. Oh well. Anyway, it's just a few modifications. Hopefully the chain will not hit this bar, but if it does, I'm going to have to modify it. Okay, the only way I figured on how to get this uh, chain through this sprocket is either... I have to remove this uh, cover or press the clutch in and turn the gear, oh, which is not easy. Well, on the BMX, I made a good decision to put the offset on the back sprocket facing out. But, I do have a problem here. And the problem is this bar. So, I'm going to have to modify it. And the only way to do it 
is cut it and bring it out more it won't interfere with my uh, feet or the pedals I just need to bring it out maybe a half an inch so these are things that I didn't uh, look forward to doing but I see people putting the motor back here making brackets put it out here they don't have to uh, modify anything over here or whatever you know uh, that's fine or whatever I just didn't want to do that I want to have the motor motor in the center so yeah I'll just modify this a bit no big deal just more time That is freaking hot. I don't know why, but I always keep doing stupid things like that. I was just going to touch it again. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill this in with weld and then I'm gonna hook this back into here. Well, not bend it back, but I gotta maybe put a, a one inch by one eighth flat stock in here. And I think that'll work fine. Okay, that's what I did with this bar here. I moved, I just moved it out a little bit. No big deal. Uh, she's almost ready to go. What I need to do now is I'm gonna remove the, um, the handlebars, the forks, the sprocket, the pedals. And I'm going to sand her all down and uh, get her ready for paint. I haven't decided what color I'm going to paint it, but... I think it may be a black and blue. Sexy machine is already black and red. So, I don't know. Maybe this one should be black and red. I haven't decided yet. Anyway, I'm going to leave this video here. Uh, my next one is going to be the painting and uh, probably the test run. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys later.